What does a law firm office manager do? This is a question you asked me down in the comments of another video, so I'm going to answer it for you today on this episode of The Inside BS Show. Hi, I'm Dave Lorenzo, and today I'm answering your question, what does a law firm office manager do? Well, there are six really important tasks that just about every law firm office manager does. I'm going to talk about each of those. I'm also going to give you a seventh task that you should never, ever have your law firm office manager do. I'll explain why, and I'll do that at the end of the video, so stick with me to the end. If you're watching this video and you're wondering what does a law firm office manager do, you're gonna love the free gift I have for you. It's my revenue roadmap, it's my marketing plan for a law firm, I'm gonna give that to you for free. Let's dive right into the content today. The first thing a law firm office manager does is administrative tasks. That's right. Wondering what a law firm office manager does? Well, that's administrative tasks. So everything from keeping the supplies for the office fully stocked to arranging the office space, who sits where, making sure everyone has the desks and the computers and the all the accoutrement, if you will. Everything they need, the, everything the law firm team needs to function, that's what the office manager does in a law firm. They make sure that you have an office, they make sure you have a desk, they make sure that you have a computer and a monitor and a mouse, they make sure you have papers, pens, all the administrative stuff. That's what a law firm office manager does. They also usually will handle the parking space assignment, they handle the security badges to come and go, they coordinate with the building. If you don't own the building, they coordinate the office space with the building, they manage the meeting rooms and who uses the meeting rooms when. All of those administrative tasks are handled by the office manager. Number two, the second thing, in response to your question, what does a law firm office manager do? The second thing they do, human resources activity. In mid-sized law firms and in small law firms, the office manager is also the HR coordinator. This means that they handle the benefits administration, everything from the 401k to payroll, to making sure that the employee I-9 records, the immigration records are all in order and in compliance. Anything related to the administrative functions of HR, the law firm office manager does that. The third thing, when we look at a law firm office manager's daily responsibilities, the third thing is they usually handle some kind of marketing. Now, sometimes this means just doing direct mail campaigns or maybe running the law firm's email marketing system. Sometimes the office manager has a marketing coordinator and the marketing coordinator reports to the office manager and oftentimes that will mean that they handle social media, they handle email marketing, maybe a print newsletter, and if they do an occasional direct mail campaign or holiday cards, that sort of thing. Most of the time, if the law firm office manager is handling the marketing, the marketing plan is not very sophisticated. If you're ready to take a step up and get a marketing director, you're gonna love the free gift I have for you today. I want you to scroll down to the description that's included with this video. In the description, you'll see a line there that says free gift from Dave. Click on the link below that. That link is revenueroadmapguide.com. That's my marketing plan for a law firm. So if you click on that, you'll enter your name and your contact information and you will immediately gain access to this law firm marketing plan guide all you need to do is read it and answer the questions and you'll have a solid marketing plan you can use for your law firm for the next year. Now, if you have a director of marketing in your firm, you can fill out the information and hand it to the law firm marketing director. If you don't, hand, hand it to the law firm office manager and see what he or she can do with it. This is your law firm marketing plan guide. Download it now for free. The link is in the description. The fourth thing the law firm office manager will do is payroll. 
This includes all of the staff. It oftentimes will include all of the professionals, including the attorneys and the paralegals. And payroll sometimes can be complex, but most of the time it's automated. You use an outside service. The law firm office manager will often have oversight over payroll. Now, you may hire a payroll clerk and that payroll clerk may report to the law firm office manager, but payroll is usually something in a small to mid-sized firm that the law firm office manager handles. The fifth thing that a law firm office manager handles is bookkeeping and billing. Yes, that's right. In a small to mid-sized firm, the law firm office manager will often have responsibility for bookkeeping and billing. There may be an accounts payable and accounts receivable clerk, somebody doing both jobs, and that person may also do the bookkeeping, but they usually report up into the law firm office manager. The sixth thing the law firm office manager will do is handle information technology, IT. Now, a small to mid-sized firm will outsource their IT capabilities, but the office manager at the law firm will manage that function. Now, as the firm grows, a number of things will need to be separated out because the law firm office manager will probably become a chief operating officer and the firm will hire a chief finance officer, a chief financial officer. You always should separate the finance functions from the law firm office manager's function and I recommend that the marketing function be separated as well and the marketing function report directly to the managing partner or managing shareholder. And that is the seventh and bonus thing that a law firm office manager should do. When he or she becomes overwhelmed, they should go to the managing shareholder or go to the management committee and recommend that finance and marketing be separated. The law firm office manager has enough responsibility with the administrative tasks, the human resources tasks, and all that goes along with it. Think about it. If you've got 25 or 30 people in a law firm, this is a small law firm, but that's 25 or 30 people who have benefits and payroll and administrative needs. All of those things are all consuming and the law firm office manager will have to attend to them. When you get to the size of maybe 25 or 30 lawyers, you gotta separate finance because finance is too important to have somebody who's overwhelmed overseeing it. You also have to separate out marketing because without marketing there is no business coming into the firm. So the marketing tasks and the finance tasks should be separated when the law firm gets to about 30 attorneys because with 30 attorneys and maybe 15 additional paralegals and 10 or 15 support staff, you've got a real good size business there. It's too much for the law firm office manager to do all of that. Those are the six things the law firm office manager does. Those are also some things that should be separated out. My name is Dave Lorenzo and I'm here every day with great new strategy for you. Sometimes it's marketing strategy, sometimes it's law firm strategy, and sometimes it's strategy in another professional service altogether. We handle professional service strategy. That's all we've done for the last 30 years. And this YouTube video is one of many. I look forward to seeing you right back here again tomorrow. Until then, here's hoping you make a great living and live a great life.